Hey guys, what's up? Josh Fearson here. And I know this guy has been destroyed in arguments so many times, but I saw this video on his Facebook, and I knew I just had to make fun of him and basically call him out at the same time. Let's begin. So there's an article that's going viral, a picture of a dad that went to Walmart, took back one of his son's toys that he had gotten for his birthday that he didn't care for, and he let his t son go back to the toy department and choose whatever toy he wanted to. If you want to form your own opinion about the article he's talking about, I'm going to put a link down below to the article itself. Only for his little boy to pick out a little girl's toy, a little mermaid doll. And, well, the dad says, I'm going to let you choose. And everybody's loving this dad in the picture that he posted to Facebook because he's letting his son choose and express who he really wants to be. So, what's your point? Really? Since when do kids make good choices? <laughs> Dude, your fucking kids are right there. Really? Since when do kids make good choices? Oh my god. Oh my god. We live in this society that thinks that kids are supposed to make choices like that and that we're not supposed to choose for them. We're supposed to let them express themselves. Okay, Josh, let me tell you something. There's a difference between express yourself and telling right from wrong. If you can express yourself, just don't be surprised when someone points out your flaws. When someone does that, you learn from it so you don't do it again. It's common sense. Seriously, since when do kids make good choices? If you give a kid the choice between playing in the yard or playing in the street, if he picks the street, are you just going to say, sure, go out there, just have a good time? You know, my little sweetie by her except she could play in the street, and I let her. She wanted to express herself by drawing chocks in the road. That was until she got hit by a truck. You know, she did, but at least I can say as a parent, she was expressing herself. If you give a, a, a kid a choice, he's probably going to choose candy over peas and carrots. It doesn't mean it's what's good for him. That's why the Bible says, train up a child. I'm looking in this Bible and I can't find anything. Oh wait, I found something in the way that he should go. Why? Because kids need to know that it's not just filling, son. What's one plus one? Well, maybe he doesn't say two. Maybe he says, ah, uh, 83. Well, of course, one plus one's not 83. <laughs> Next thing you're going to tell me, nine plus 10 is 21. Wait. Well, does it feel like 83 to you? Because if 83 is how you express yourself, no, I'm going to tell him the truth. One plus one is two. Why? Because then he's going to grow up just learn, not even learn, learning T today, Junior. How to use math. So me, I train up a boy in the way that he should go by teaching him how to use a firearm. Oh shit, a white Christmas man with a gun. Everybody fucking run. Teaching him how to use a gun and proper gun safety. See, my son Samuel, he's learning today as we're in the backyard. You'll shoot your eye out. And guess what? For all of you liberal, spineless, no good, coward kind of people, since you want to be gen gender neutral, Yeah, we are superior. Guess who else I'm teaching to use a gun? My daughters. They're learning how to use a gun. I'm going to teach them how to use a gun to kill all you atheists. Fucking hate you all. <laughs> so Samuel, take that gun right there. You know how to hold it. And why don't you go ahead and hit that? Okay, okay, okay. First off, pause. This kid's got fucking death in his eyes. This guy is teaching a fucking 10 year old to shoot firearms. And his fucking daughters. Jesus Christ, you're a fucking terrible parent. But, not unless the terrible parent, this kid is probably gonna end up murdering someone. We can all thank Josh for being such a great parent. Target right there. And fire. Hit it? Yeah. Good. Can you imagine, like, the fucking kid not even hitting the target? Way to go, Billy. Great. You were close. A little doubt. Billy, you hit the fucking cat. God damn it. Where, where's the fucking belt? This little son of a bitch. That's gun control, ladies and gentlemen. That's gun control. A boy that knows how to properly fire a gun. I'm going to teach my daughter, too. That's for you, guy who has no cojones. 
who needs to grow a pair and be a dad and train a child? Thou globby bottle of cheap, stinking chip oil! Come and get one in the yarbles! If you have any yarbles! Anyways, God bless you guys. Have a great day. If you agree with me, would you take a moment and click share on the side of the bottom of this video? Like and comment below. If you're not my friend already on Facebook, click my name at the top of the video. Let's be friends. We you better better share the shit out of this thing. But Josh, let's not be friends. And let's be honest, you have no friends.